City. All New York City schools are turning toward technology to try and reduce the number of sick days students take through an app. Parents can now track the health data of students in their child's classes. And as Briella Tomasetti explains, get alerts when something like strep throat or even the flu are going around the school. Do you feel good today? Yes. Sure, you've heard of smartphones and smart TVs, but now smart thermometers are helping schools take a proactive approach to cold and flu season. There's no system to tell you where and when illness is spreading. How do you stop the next outbreak before it becomes an epidemic if you don't know where and when it started? The smart thermometers created by San Francisco-based startup Kinza help schools track illnesses in real time. Parents can take their kids' temperatures at home and then opt in to share that information on Kinza's smartphone app. For those who have privacy concerns, company founders say, rest assured, it's all on a completely anonymous basis. What we're sharing is insights. Insights are around the level of illness in the school or the grade. It's purely insights, not your information. Not only do parents learn which illnesses are circulating in their own schools and neighborhoods, but they can even get medical advice at the simple touch of a button. It's nice to know, like, oh, this is the, these are the parameters, this is when I should take them to the doctor, this is like, there's a worrying pattern. This year, Kinza, in partnership with Lysol, donated free thermometers to 1,400 schools across the nation. 100 of those schools, including Manhattan Star Academy, are located right here in the tri-state area. So I will be able to see, okay, some Something is going around in this classroom, so I will be able to alert those parents who have immunocompromised kids um, to, you know, to, to do whatever they do to help their kids stay healthy. But Kinza's outreach expands far beyond the nurse's office. The innovative technology is now used in more than 750,000 households across the nation. Reporting on the Upper West Side, Briella Tomasetti, Fox 5 News.